Hi, this is Jake from Optimus Futures, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to connect to the Awanda data feed on Optimus Flow. So I'm pleased to announce that we have released a connection to the Awanda data feed. This will now allow our US Forex traders to access the Awanda data feed straight from Optimus Flow to access and trade Forex. So if you are interested in trying out the Awanda connection with Optimus Flow, you can drop us an email at support at optimusfutures.com or head over to our community forum. Simply write down your email, request that you'd like to try Optimus Flow out, um, and we'll send you over an invite. So it's as simple as that. Now with this video, like I said, I will be showing you how to connect to the Awanda data feed. I'll be using a demo account, but this process will remain the exact same with a live account. So the first thing you'll need to do if you don't have one already is go to awanda.com and register for a free demo or practice trading account. Now I won't go through that step-by-step -step process. It's fairly simple. All you need to do is just go to awanda.com and pretty much just sign up for a demo. Once you do sign up and you log in for the first time, you'll be brought to the following page. You can see we're logged in with a practice account. If you do have a live account, it would say so here. Either way, this um, you know central hub here is pretty much the same whether you're using practice or demo. So once you're on this page, head over to the bottom left corner under the My Services section and click on Manage API Access. Once you're brought to this page, you'll see there is a green generate button. This is to generate a key to Oanda's API. Now our platform is running off of the Oanda API, so this is how we're gonna connect. All you need to do is click on this green generate button and just after a few seconds here, it'll generate this random string of code. Simply left click, drag and hold to copy down this string of numbers and letters and then press control C on your keyboard to copy or you can right click and copy that way. Once you have this copied down, all we need to do is head over to the Optimus Flow trading platform. You see I already have the window up here to access this, all you need to do is go to the top right hand corner, click on favorite connections, choose Oanda. For our case, we'll be using demo, or again, if you have a real account, just click real. Now from here, this is our access token form. So all we have to do is press control V or right click and then paste to paste that in there and then click on the connect button. If we just give it a few seconds here, it should automatically just connect us to the Oanda data feed, no problem. There we have it. We're automatically connected to Oanda now. We can even check in on our accounts here. So we'll go up to the account button in the top left-hand corner, account info. You'll see in this dropdown, we have our primary Oanda account. And that is the account that we're using to trade with here. So if you wanna go back, you can actually create yourself multiple accounts so if we go to the account hub here, you can have the option of creating yourself a new sub account within this original dim account or add funds to your existing one if you run out. To do this, we can click on the add account button here and it'll bring us to this small portal. As you can see, the account that we're using, this is considered the primary account. Here we have it. And this is the same one that shows in Optimus Flow under Oanda connection. You can see we have the balance of $100,000. The username here is primary. So we're pretty much, you know, we're, we're set up and connected correctly. Now, excuse me, I accidentally just navigated off of that page. So you'll have to forgive me for just one second. Let's go back to the, um, that hub real quick and I'll show you how to create a sub account. So again, we'll click on add sub account here. Then all we need to do under new FX trade account, we'll click on V20 FX trade, choose a name for it so we can type in demo, choose a currency you want it based off of, we'll do US dollars, choose your leverage, we'll do 20 to one, and then click on save. Now it may take a few minutes for this to update. Um, you may even have to disconnect and then reconnect the Oanda connection guide for this to update in the platform real time. But as you can see, we now have two accounts. One has $100,000 in there. One currently has zero. If you run out of currency in your primary account, want to add more, or you wanna just add funds to your demo account here, you can click on deposit, 
click on select of course this is if this was a live account you would choose a method of funding such as a credit card or paypal something along those lines for our case we're just using demo currency so we can pretty much just type in 100 us dollars click on proceed the funds should instantly transfer as you can see they did now we have hundred dollars in the account you can do the same thing for withdrawals just click on withdraw click on select withdraw however much you want you'll probably have to put in your billing address and you know billing information for a live account but again it's pretty much the same thing we can also transfer funds among one account to another we don't have enough money in there but we can click on transfer choose the account we want to transfer money to just pretty much type in how much we want to transfer 50,000 click on proceed so now we have 50k in each account that's pretty much it for this video just wanted to show, show you you know the technical aspect behind connecting to the awenda data feed we'll have more videos in the future showing you how to trade forex on this platform or pretty much just how to access forex symbols but again we just wanted to, to uh, stick to the technical aspect of getting started with the Wanda demo account and connecting on Optimus Flow. If you did have any questions, please post them in the comment section below. You can also head over to our community forum and post them in the Optimus Flow comments, questions, um, and concerns post. This is where we're looking for customer feedback. So for those of you who have tested it out, we would really love your feedback on any suggestions you may have or issues you ran into with the platform. We'd love to hear your feedback. That'll help us make this platform perfect. Again, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Optimus Futures content. Thanks for watching.